We have a new church. Amen. We have a new pastor. Amen. Pastor has a new congregation. <laughs> a growing congregation, thank the Lord. Amen. So we are all in a season of newness. Yes. Whether we know it or not. And the Greek translation of the word season is kairos. K-A-Y-R-O-S. And the meaning of season is specific points in time or specific points of time. So we're all in a specific point of time. We're all in a new season. And in God's word, in our Bible, basic instructions before leaving earth, from Genesis to Revelation, God talks about seasons. If we look at Genesis chapter 1, verse 14, God talks about when he makes the light on the fourth day, the greater light and the lesser light, the greater light today, lesser light tonight. And he said, and it shall be for seasons, for days and for years. And if we look at Revelation 20, all the way through the Bible to Revelation 23, talks about Satan being loosed in the earth for a little season. So God talks about seasons. We live our life in seasons. Anointing comes on us for seasons. Seasons to do whatever it is that God has called us to do when he moves us from one level to another. Our temptation or our natural tendencies is to see our seasons with the natural eye. And when we see things with the natural eye, we can start believing what we see. When we see 